Hello Twin Flames, it's Saturday the 25th of February today, Super Saturday, so I'm going to bring in this gorgeous Spirit Animal Oracle to see what Spirit Guide is around us today and why. So we're going to pull an energy for the feminine, the masculine and the journey. So thank you angels. Which animal is around the feminine today? Which animal is around the divine masculine today? Jumped across and the energy around the connection. Thank you, thank you, wow, okay. Look at this first of all for the masculine. We've got the butterfly spirit. Transformation is beautiful. Transformation is beautiful. That means embrace where the masculines are right now because they've never been here before. They've never been in the situation they're in right now where they are changing this way. Things are moving forward. Their transformation right now is beautiful. It's magical. And it may be painful, because they're going through it a lot physically right now. But they are becoming who they're born to be. They are growing those wings. The stag is becoming the eagle. And you may see butterflies as a symbol of their transformation and the beauty of the journey. And you're being reminded to embrace that today. But if you see the stag or the eagle, it's the way they transform. You know, the stag is the way they grow up spiritually. The way they become more emotionally mature the way they understand things in a different way. And the eagle is the promise that they are on their way and doing what they've come here to do. So the butterfly today is a symbol and they're giving me a block in the throat as well. And, you know, it's about changes to bring you back together and back into contact. But this is about the way they are transforming to be with you. And not only to be with you, Divine Feminine, but to be in the energy of who they've come here to be. They're becoming the person they've come here to be. And that's beautiful. So you may see butterflies today, whether it's in your real world or your virtual world, as a symbol of the masculine transformation. Mm -hmm. And wow. You know, that's really powerful as well because I've got builders next door. And I have to show you what they're telling me. If I can find my deck, bear with me a second. Here it is. Because that sounded like, you know, releasing of gas or what you may call a fart. And I have to tell you what they're telling me through my intuition here. And that was, they moved something or something made that kind of noise and it just brought up that energy because when they are releasing gas, let me just find the card, bear with me a second. They have a desire, okay? A desire to create. That means a desire to create the new to transform and make things happen in their life but they may not have the motivation or the courage to act on it because they're holding themselves back and they have fear around the timing issue they want to do it now so what you know if they are releasing gas today and you may not be aware of that but you know if they are and i feel they are because i just heard that and it made me connect with that too then they, they want to do it now this is about their changes and their transformation occurring right now and i'll just hold that there a second so you can just have a quick look at that card you know and this could be on the toilet or being a bit constipated as well they're giving me that too you know i always have to tell you what they're showing me and you know we are spiritual beings yes but we also do have a physical experience and that physical experience includes the body and the body has symptoms and things we go through so we can go through things that affect us. And so do the masculines. You know, I've been picking up, picking up on a lot of their symptoms recently. So we've also got constipation. So I feel today, you know, it's more they're holding things in that need to be released than letting things out on the loo. So, you know, I feel they could be constipated and there could be a lot of gas because of that. So the constipation is fear of letting go. Or having constant control. And, you know, they do try and control things in their life because they, they know they need to make changes, but there is those fears around it, it changing itself. So trust the flow of your life to regulate things again and affirm there is always a plan. So right now the masculines are trying to find out that plan and that's what they're doing today. So for the feminine today, we've got the wombat spirit. Look at this, be at home. Be at home. So be at home in your own body today. Enjoy yourself. Maybe you're spending the, the day at home. It's a Saturday. You're just at home today doing your own thing. Enjoying yourself. Maybe you're just not going anywhere or, you know, you're just enjoying being you. But I tell you this, wherever you go, whatever you do, you are at home because you are at home in your own skin. 
And when you feel content in your own skin, wherever you go feels like home because you're the home, you're the lighthouse, you're that warrior. And that's why when your masculine is with you, wherever it is, whether it's at your house or their house or it's completely different, out of both of your comfort zones somewhere new, it still feels like you are at home because you are. You're at home with each other because a home is not a building or a place or a location, it's a feeling. And it's that feeling of coming home. So I feel there's a lot of acceptance here today where you're feeling more comfortable with the way things are and the way you are and the way the journey is because you know your masculine is coming home. So I feel a real comfort energy, a real balanced energy around the feminine today, relaxed, feeling at ease and feeling at peace. And we've got for the journey, look at this, the wolf spirit and the wolf is connected with telepathy and psychic power and connecting in a 5d way it says turn knowledge into wisdom and that's what you're doing you're becoming wise through everything you're going through and the experiences you are having and we've got the owl spirit also connected with wisdom you see clearly now so the masculine see a way out they may still be struggling a little bit because they're having all this gas so they want to create they have this desire the sense of urgency and they also have the motivation, but they need the courage. And that's what the angels are giving them right now, the courage. So the owl is saying, see clearly. We have to go into the darkness to see things clearly. And the seahorse spirit says, watch and wait. So observe what's going on and wait. It's all coming in. The masculines are waiting for the right time. And I feel they are observing you today. So they may be watching your social media very closely today. They are watching what's going on around them today and they're waiting for the right time. And feminines, you may feel like you're waiting around, but enjoy what you're doing. Enjoy this day. You know, this is a day where you may be at home, so you may just want to stick your favourite show on and relax and eat your nice meals and do what you're being guided to do. And that brings in contentment. But if you are going out, you know, you're going out with you. It doesn't matter who else you're going out with, friends, family, kids. You're going out with you and be your own best friend and enjoy this day because there is a huge transformation taking place, not just within the masculines, but within you to feel balanced, to align with yourself, to move towards the union. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.